guys for today's video we are going to share to you how to make a deep fried chicken in a hot pepper sauce and this is the ingredients so let's get started first add a 150 gram of starch powder to a small bowl and mix them with a one cup of water then let it sit for at least one hour one hour later drain the remaining water then wash well the chicken next dice a 50 gram of green bell pepper and chop small amount of chili to make a little bit of spicy then chop the green onion we will also need a small amount of ginger and of course minced garlic now let's slice the chicken into bite-sized pieces place it on a mixing bowl all the chicken and let's season this with salt pepper powder and mix then add one pieces of egg but only add the egg white not together with the yolk then add the starch water and mix using your hand now we're going to combine all of these 1.5 tablespoon of sugar you can also use white sugar 1.5 tablespoon of soy sauce 2.5 tablespoon of vinegar 1 tablespoon of cooking wine 4 tablespoon of water and 1 tablespoon of oyster sauce then mix and now it's ready to fry our chicken prepare the cooking oil and setting your flame into medium heat and add the chicken if you are new to our channel we always fry for two times to make more crispier and more delicious first frying is about five minutes over the medium heat okay first frying is done set aside first and wait the temperature to go up again and do the second frying over the high heat deeply fry the chicken you need to make more crispier as like a little bit of strong the chicken skin because we're going to mix them with the sauce Continue your flame into high heat, then add 3 tablespoons of chili oil and salt the minced garlic, ginger, green onion, and stir. Now let's add the bell pepper red chili. You can add more chili if you like more spicy. Now let's add the sauce and give it a nice stir. Now add the fried chicken, coat them with the sauce, mix them well. And last, add 1 tablespoon of sesame oil and give it a last stir and it's ready to place it on the plate. And now it's done! This is very delicious.